I'd like you to go ahead and click on the Sign Up Now button, the orange Sign Up Now button beneath the $6.95 per month. This is your first step to success. Go ahead and click on the Sign Up button now. Then you'll be instructed on what to do after that. Thank you for signing up. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to sign up for a Bluehost account. Let's have you go ahead and click on the Sign Up Now for Bluehost on top of the Easy Drupal Tutorials page. And once you click on that link, you're going to land on this Bluehost page right here. Once you go ahead and do that, you're going to want to click on the Sign Up Now button, which I've done right here. And let's go ahead and say that you're going to register a domain called Cherish Moment Now. And you have the option of registering as a .com, .net, .org. We're just going to use .com. Since I'm a privacy nut, I'm just going to go and check off Add Bluehost Privacy for free. Then we just click the Next button. Wait for the page to load. And looks like we've got some good news. The domain that I chose is available. So if you see the screen and you show that the name is in the bold, so what you're going to want to do is scroll down to the account information and you type in your first name, your last name, the country to which you reside, your street address, your city, the state or province, your zip code, your phone number, and also your email address. It's important to type in your email address because this is where your welcome letter will be sent along with your receipt with your login, control panel, username, and password information. Then you want to scroll down and select the package. I would highly recommend selecting either the 24 or the 36 month package because that's the cheapest plan to go with. It's only $6.95 a month. The nice thing about registering a domain here is uh, it's free forever. So for instance, I went ahead and registered the domain name cashcats.com. I actually paid $150 and that's for 10 years at register.com. Had I known about this, I would have gone to Bluehost and registered my domain name for free forever. So that's a great benefit uh, to registering a hosting uh, company and installing Drupal with Bluehost. So that's why I highly recommend it. And so let's go ahead and pretend that you uh, select the 36 month plan. Then you go ahead and type in the password. This is the password that you're going to log in with on the control panel. And you're going to want to write that down somewhere in a safe place. Then you type in the password one more time. It has to be between 5 to 15 characters. And let's scroll down now to the billing information. Uh, if you have a PayPal account, you can just go ahead and click Pay with PayPal. If you don't, you want to pay with a credit card. Pull down on the credit card type, and you can select MasterCard American Express Discover. And on the second box, enter your credit card number, then the expiration date and your three-digit code at the back of your card. And then you basically scroll down here, read the terms of service, and check I confirm I've read and agreed to everything, and click the Next button. Once you click the Next button, your credit card will be processed through a secure server, and you now are very close to setting up a Drupal website, and I will show you that in the next tutorial. Thank you for signing up for Bluehost.